Hey everybody, it's Melissa here from danceforplace.com where competitors come first. And I'm going to reveal to you right here who I'm interviewing right now, a very special Danielle Novikov. Let me move back over here so I can reach. Actually, let's take a couple steps forward. There we go. All right, so this is Daniel and his mom, Ala. Can you say hello to everybody out there? Hello. Hello. <laughs> All right, now, Daniel just finished doing the show here tonight at the Desert Classic, and I wanted to talk to him because he's a pretty special guy here in the ballroom industry. He's done a lot in his little amount of time on this earth. How old are you? I'm eight and a half. Eight and a half years old. And let me, I had to write down his accomplishments because it's such a list I couldn't remember. So, Daniel, you are the world preteen um, pro am champion, the US preteen one Latin and ballroom world representative champion. You're going to Paris this year to represent US. Woohoo! And you may have seen Daniel on PBS's America's Ballroom Challenge recently. So, and you dance at Edelweiss Ballroom, which is in, where's the, it's in San Dimas, in San Dimas. In San Dimas California. Okay, so I wanted to ask you a few things. First of all, how do you manage to be so amazing in your dancing and still be a kid? Because I see you doing other stuff besides dancing. How do you do it all? I just, when I was in the studio, I'm looking at my mom's students and I just like dancing and I told my mom, can I dance at a competition? And I danced my first time and then Actually, his first competition was Desert Classic, 2012. So he was hanging here around, and he said, Mom, can I dance? And I said, Daniel, you don't know how to dance. He said, can I do a little cha-cha? Can you show me basic step? So we actually let him dance. We bought pants for you, short, and he, you were dancing just basic cha-cha. That's how he started. Awesome. So you're, this is like an anniversary for you here, to come yes, back and do the show at Desert right. Classic. That's awesome. Okay, now, how, so that was what year, now how long have you been dancing? I've been dancing for almost three years. For three years? Okay, now, we can kind of guess, but who's your teacher? My teacher is my mom. <laughs> and your mom is, is Alan Novakova right here, this beautiful lady standing next to me. Okay, so your mom's not going to hear this, but tell me, how hard is it really for you to dance with your mom as your teacher? Or is it easy? It is. Oh, oh, awesome. Well, she's a great teacher and a great mom, so you really lucked out there, right? Yes. <laughs> okay, now, you actually do ten dances. Is Can you pick a favorite among the ten? Uh, one favorite or two favorites? Okay, go ahead and take two favorites. One in one division is Paso Doble, and one in the other division is Tango. Ooh, so both of the, like, real powerful dances. Okay, very cool. I love that. Okay, now, I want to know something else too here. I want to know, now you're dancing a lot right now. What is your goal for your dancing as you get older? Um, to try to be a world champion. Well, you're already a world champion. Not a national <laughs> champion, not a world champion. World pro-am champion, right? Yeah, okay. but not a world, not pro-am champion, but world champion. Got it. I think you're on your way. you got a pretty good start right now. <laughs> okay, so there's a lot of kids out there who are doing ballroom right now. Mm -hmm. Since you're so successful, what advice can you give the other kids out there? Or maybe even to kids who haven't started dancing yet and they think what you do is really cool. What can they do to get started? Just try to watch um, professionals and learn and then tell their parents or teachers um, that they want to dance and have fun. So you still have fun when you get out there? Yeah. <laughs> I've seen you. You definitely look like you're having a lot of fun. Thank you. <laughs> okay, so you are such an inspiration to a lot of people out there. And I want to give you a good luck. Good luck with everything you're going to do, and especially as you represent the U.S. here in Paris in December, you said, Ola? December 4th. Awesome. Well, we're going to be watching your star rising. Thank you so much, Daniel. You're welcome. <laughs> Thank you. All right, guys, so there it is, future world champion right here. You saw it first on danceboardplace.com. We'll see you guys later this week. Bye-bye.